Okay, um, now quick um, to back up really, um, just make sure everything's converting. So you, you check your collection, you notice that um, nothing is converting, it's zero, the bottom one. Um, this is so uh, we check, press info and press OK and just go to um, set up set up music db scroll down to backup backup and it just give you the options of things that you have insert um, sort of connected to the device it could be your usb external ports or your network um, you know, just select the um, second one is uh, an external hard drive you just click it you know just take a moment to um, to work out the um, space okay that the moment it says the uh, what's on the cocktail audio is only 53 gig and I have 300 same one gig on the um, external um, hard drive so you can just press OK and it will just back up and one, once it's done just OK and that's it really and another thing that you need to be aware of is that um, sometimes your available space might be smaller than your music database size but if it's an increment it's fine because that just means it's going to overwrite the um, the old files so you just need to be aware of that it doesn't mean that you haven't got enough space because if there's an increment of what you had before it, obviously the, the only the new ones should be added to the um, to, to, to the um, uh, the new um, uh, backup so as long as you're aware of that then, then that's fine um, um, another way uh, to back up is you, you can back up to a NAS device, um, network storage, or you can just back up to a um, shared share directory. So, um, it's just a quick demo, really. Um, of course, you check your collection to make sure nothing is converting. Um, you go to your browser and add your share. So, you, you search your network. Um, if you create a shared folder, so you have a backup shared folder directory and um, anything. So, I mean, you, you've got a space there, so you can do whatever you like with it. Um, you know, um, of course, you can create the shared folder and call it backup or whatever you like. And also, as the um, device backs up, it will create its own backup folder, so it's not going to mess up other things that you have on the network. So, I'm just going to call this. Um, music backup really just to um, demonstrate you press ok and then it creates it so when um, you have a share there um, you just jump back um, go over here you want to back up press ok click your share it will take a moment to sort of calculate the space on the network and things like that, you know, it's a good way to back up when you, you know, good files on the network and things like that. And it would sort of work it out as well. So you, you know, my my net my network drive has um, a space of 185, and my music DB has just 53. So I have enough enough space to to back up. And you know, so it's best to do this on the wide network because you don't have any, you don't want any signal issues. Um, on your Wi-Fi and also Wi-Fi only has 300 megabits per second even you know in, in 2014 so it's I suppose um, I think the um, uh, I think Oxford University or um, Taiwan are both doing research on, on sort of trying to help um, increase the, um, the bandwidth on your Wi-Fi which is going to be good soon um, some other universities as well so MIT doing some things um, 
but anyway, um, hopefully uh, Wi-Fi will be good soon. But at the moment, it's best to back up on a network with a wired because you don't want anything going wrong, really. Quite, you know. Um, but you know, hope that helps. Uh, thank you. And you know, backing up on shared, it's it's a lot quicker and new for us. Thanks.